Hi, it's me, your girl in Dynamo, and welcome back to my tagless channel. Hello, guys. How are you all on either side of the? universe of guys for today's video as if you've been in my channel we are back in Darwin in Northern Territory dito sa Australia so guys nakita nyo naman so after we settle our caravan we are back on our caravaning on Australia so the next day guys dumating yung kuya ni Jax and ang ating sis na si ate Wilms ang kanyang um, asawang Pilipina. So, anyway, highway, we will explore the area dito sa Darwin kasi nga hinintay namin sila kasi they will fly from South Australia to Northern Territory which is in Darwin in the top of Australia. Guys, may kita niya sa map. And yes, guys, because tomorrow, the next day, will be the Territory Day na pinalabas ko na sa aking previous video. So, guys, are you ready to explore the central business dito sa Northern Territory? the uh, territory which is the darwin city guys so guys are you ready what are we waiting for happy watching yeah, we just cut through those two buildings there and i don't really know it's down here i don't know if it's just like a fancy restaurant area or Oh yeah, there's the oil tunnels or something around here, aren't they? Explore and find out. Clark, I'll go yeah. through the drill, the drill will like, skip or something yeah. and scratch. Like, no. Plus you probably need the riveting tool as well to like punch the yeah. like the bolt holes into... Oh, the riveting tool, no worries, I'll just borrow one erase. Oh yeah. But um, I've got riveting tools at home anyway, so... But nah, all that sort of shit, mate. Yeah. It's worth Especially because once you do it as well, you probably don't know it's actually like gonna, like you have to cross your fingers, it's actually is gonna fit when you actually gotta finally do it. Because yeah. I think it'll give you a paper stencil and stuff, but yeah, you never know it's gonna line up at the end. Drill through that, the guard, or, or a hole saw through the guard. Yeah. That's a little over two grand. Yeah. And that was, wait, that's about a thousand dollars less than what they even quoted. Oh, shit, I thought the, um, I thought snorkels were maybe like 700 including the snorkels and the install because I thought the snorkels nah, are only maybe up four or five hundred or so and then nah, only a couple of L's. Depends what brand, uh, TJM or um, Safari, they're generally not cheap. Oh, okay. Um, I think the snorkels alone are about 700 bucks. And then this um, couple there had their son there as well. And he goes, I'm not scared when he ran out there. Make sure that they went and he's running his ass. <laughs> Getting chased by the floor. Oh, it's a swimming area here as well. Like a swimming beach. We are now at the Darwin City. It's a suburb in a metropolitan Darwin, which comprises the original settlement, the central business district, parkland, and other built up areas. It is a traditional country and waterways of the Laria people. Little information about Darwin is the capital city of the Northern Territory in Australia. It is known for its tropical climate, diverse population, and rich history. We are now at the Darwin Water Promenade. This is a scenic area for dining and entertainment. You can see some building apartment around, and you can see later the Darwin Convention Center and the other Darwin Way Lagoon, the Darwin Water Lagoon, and other Stroke Hill Wharf. Situated on the Timor Sea, Darwin serves as a gateway to Southeast Asia and is one of the most cool multicultural cities in Australia. Darwin experiences a tropical climate with distinct wet and dry seasons. The wet season from November to April brings heavy rainfall and humidity, while the dry season from May to October is characterized by warm temperature and clear skies. That's smoothies. Is that the food? But that's not for it's just solid fusion, I don't know if that means Filipino. We'll see if that actually is. Wait a I don't know if that means. Yummy snowflake. And, uh... Oh, pork adobo. Chicken barbecue bag thing. Loaded sisig. Oh, pork sisig loaded chips. Is it 
bright or? Yeah. Today we are heading to check the Kindness Festival 2024 and the entrance is free. Everyone can go in and out. There's a lot of food stalls around, food trucks around. Big cars, big bag cars. Oh, it's good for you. Kids have to shoot up high enough. <laughs> Oh, it's for that ratos. Is that paid or? Good evening, everybody. Yeah. Why does that? Let's give a big shout out. Shout out. Everybody who's here on Twitter. I think shout out now. Hello, ma'am, sir. This year, our theme for this year, as you all know, is Ripples of Kindness. So what that means is one small act of kindness can inspire many others to spread more acts of kindness. So when talking about Ripples of Kindness, I have to do a little bit of recap to you guys to speak about how this amazing initiative, Kindness, started and how many ripples it has created. So three and a half years ago, when COVID-19 was there, a group of amazing, passionate international students came together just out of sheer desire to help others, and they started distributing some free meals. And look at three and a half years later, we are such a massive community doing events after events. And as the new team, we were quite nervous in the beginning, in December 2023, because we had a big, big legacy to carry from our original founder team. But I'm proud to say today that Kindness is Festival is the biggest multicultural festival of the territory. And I'm proud to say oh, that our goodness. team in the last six months has organized more than six initiatives and have touched more than 400 international yeah, students in many ways to help them with community engagement, Sound. settlement, employability and cultural Something integration. Uh, one more thing that I'm really proud of this new team is putting up oh. this massive festival here. We have more Philippines. Inspiration points. No, it's not Philippine, uh, it's Philippine all And guess what? At 9 p.m. we have a massive firework. So oh. stay oh. until 9 p.m. Oh. so that you can enjoy the massive firework. I won't take long uh, because I know there are more performances that you guys want to see. I just want to say that none of us, none of this would have been possible without the help of our amazing sponsors. I would like to thank anti-government for continuing support. I'm proud to say news, right? So another thing is uh, I'm very thankful to Darwin Waterfront Corporation, anti Mazer event, Mela Luca, Charles Darwin University, oh, Power and Water, International yeah, yeah. House, some of all of our sponsors. But thank so finally, thanking all of our volunteers. We'll they have put months the of recording. efforts into making this festival happen. Version. So thank you to the all the volunteers. So what I want to say... Oh, there's much. more in the back here, maybe they're here. All right. uh, one fun fact is, uh, Sushan was one of the MCs last year, so I think Jamal has to be sure to support from here. Very soon. You can see the Darwin Convention Center, the 23,000 square meters are carefully designed event space makes Darwin Convention Center the largest conference and event facility in the Northern Territory. Not far away, you can see the Aqua Park Darwin located in the waterfront to sink recreational lagoon. You can see some of the obstacle here guys, so it's a family friendly. Couldn't find the Filipino tent. <laughs> maybe, maybe it's just a food van. Should get that, I know. Hello. Oh, they got like a huge kayak there. 
the luck of a risky thing. Andrew. Yeah, you want the sun to shine on your face, otherwise you're going to be dark or the background will be oversaturated. Well, it looks like you're walking, you can see the bottom right there, so it's not that deep here until you get like, walking further. Yeah, you might as well just be yeah, Australian. Yeah, I don't know if any of um, actual Australian sun bake on grass. No. It's a very... Yeah, it's a <laughs> There's like, um, one of the dietists that my client says she's Scottish. Yeah. And we complain about the weather the other way. Oh, no, this is not new weather, no. This is like the Scottish summer. <laughs> yeah, what, top of 18 or something? <laughs> Oh, this one. Oh. So. Time to study NT. Oh, thank you. There she is, always. Oh, no. Oh yeah, we should have sent the flag enough, shouldn't we? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, maybe. <laughs> maybe this is the most. Giant pineapples. There. I think I have. Oh, it's so much cute to get your face painted. Little history about Darwin has a unique and significant history including its role during World War II when it was bombed by Japanese forces the city was also heavily impacted by cyclone crazy in 1974 which led to widespread destruction and rebuilding oh, 
somewhere for these bearish and get some. What are these? That's convention center. Uh, I reckon that's where we have to be late from tomorrow. Or oh, one of these docks here, Stokes Hill yeah. Wharf. So what's up? We, you already booked that, haven't you? There's more things around here. There's quite a few umbrellas and stuff there. Oh, there's like Bella Bar and the left side we are now at the right side of the Darwin Waterfront Lagoon oh, where's the sun? oh it's not set that way oh, people are swinging on the outside of that as well Hi. I said people are swinging on like the outside of the um, yeah you're allowed to yeah. swim out here but yeah. I think it's past here it's got to say, is there no fishing? Yeah, in Coosta Wai, nothing here. I was say, is this moving? Um, so, I don't know if it's rocking back to forth or not, or if it's just the water moving to give that illusion. Oh yeah, it does, it's because it's on both things here. Yeah. Obvious pontoon here yet. It's not mooring points or anything like that. I don't I think the cruise ship's got on the other side. Maybe that's actually that yeah, looks like probably our ship tomorrow night. Yeah. So this is probably good to make park right there. Oh, no, you expect something to like pull up to it. That'd be a big boat, wouldn't it? Hi. Probably for last year's event, looks like the fireworks go here. Because this is kind of in the foreground. Yeah. So maybe, maybe it might tow, it, like, tow them in from somewhere else. Yeah. You can set up a pontoon and then just tow it in. Yeah. That's why I want to go there too, just so hang around out there. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not sure how it works. I don't know if you get assigned or if it's, you just grab whatever table's available when you check. Yeah. Not the, oh, it's like a food court there. Yeah. Oh, lucky we So lucky we didn't go for the sunset tonight.
Oh, yeah, mate. Where are you? Not bad. We are now heading back to the waterfront precinct where we can get and grab some dinner. Darwin's multicultural population is reflected in its diverse food scene, festivals, and cultural events. The city has a vibrant art scene with numerous galleries, museums, and performances that showcase indigenous Australian art and culture. Darwin's economy is diverse with significant contributions from tourism, defense, mining, and the oil and gas industries. The city also serves as a key hub for trade and logistics in Northern Australia. Darwin is well connected by air with Darwin International Airport offering flights of various domestic and international destinations. The city is also accessible by road and is the terminus of the Gun Railway which connects it to Adelaide. Do you think this is like a side of a wave pool? Is that a restaurant over there? Yeah, no, restaurant's about corner there. Yeah, fireworks must be on the side of that rock wall if they're trying to keep people away from it all. I think so. Yeah, I don't think you're a by anyone. Ah, it's all going in the stairs there.
that's it guys that's our um fun explore walking through dito sa Darwin City sa Northern Territory nakita niyo naman ang Central Business yun talaga main area dito sa Darwin guys so nakita niyo uh, we attended the uh, kindness festival nakita niyo it's free lang guys you just uh, fill up the form through online so nag fill up ng form yung uh, wife ni uh, Koya, which is the brother of Jack. So, nakita nyo guys, kung may nakita kayo at narinig kayo kanina sa ating video na lalaki, brother po yun ni Jax. Kuya ni Jax. I call him Koya. So, si ate naman ang kanyang asawa ay Filipina po. So, anyway, so nakita nyo naman, we walk the Darwin waterfront. Nakita nyo yung mga wave doon. May area nag-wave doon, guys. And merong, um, playground, mayroong mga public access for the main beach doon sa waterfront which is in the area dun sa Darwin. So, nakita nyo, there's a food stalls. May mga uh, food stall, iba't ibang country yan, guys. Tapos, nakita nyo, there's some parades na winate namin doon, guys. Nag parades la yung mga um, countries na uh, participant. So, nakita nyo, one of the food stalls are, is the Filipino. So, may kita nyo there's a adobo doon. Kaya, tuwan-tuwa si Jax. Kasi, mostly na nandoon sa Darwin, guys. Ang mga Filipino is huge Filipino community po. Ang nasa Northern Territory, which is in Darwin. So, may kita nyo yung Darwin ay very close siya sa Indonesia and East Timor. So, nasa top siya. Pag nakita nyo yung map dito, Hindi yung Darwin. So, anyway, highway, nandito yung kuya ni Jax and si ate. Kasi they fly from South Australia, as I said earlier sa ating video. So, para sa Northern Territory, lay eh, dito sa Darwin, Australia. So, anyway, ayun na nga, nakita nyo naman yung Kindness Festival. Nakita nyo yung mga stall nila, different country participant. Wala tayong Filipino, pero yung uh, Filipino, meron silang food stall doon. So, anyway, highway, nakita nyo yung waterfront. Nakita nyo yung uh, Darwin Precinct, guys. Nakita nyo yung mga cruise ship terminal doon sa ating walking through dito sa Darwin. So, yes. After noon, nag-grab tayo ng dinner, tapos nag tayo. At the end of the day, at the end, to finish the night, um, the Kindness Festival uh, will have a um, fireworks. So, yun yung finish up nila, yung fireworks. Nakita nyo naman, it's a stunning fireworks. So, ayun na nga guys, nakita nyo, it was a fun um, walking tour around the uh, Darwin Waterfront Precinct. Um, area, playground, beach, main public access, guys. Very peaceful, very tropic vibes, guys, dito. Hindi lumalamig dito, guys. Um, humid, sunny. So, yes, guys. So, yan na nga, guys. This the end of our video for today. I hope you enjoy watching. You learned something today. Plus, you had fun for today's video, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for supporting our video. And mega love shout out each wonderful, beautiful people of the universe. Thank you from the bottom of my hypothalamus. Please like if you did enjoy our video for today. Yeah. And please do subscribe if you haven't yet. And don't forget to yeah. hit the bell button for you to get notified for our next video. And please yeah. comment down below if you like this video. Po. And yeah. see, you. And see you on my next one. Bye-bye, guys. Be good. You take care. Be safe. And mwah. Ciao.